raising taxes for education or keeping Rutherford County affordable. That's the decision the Rutherford County Commission is going to have to make as they weigh increasing the county property tax nearly 10% in the coming year. News Channel 5's Todd Walker is just back from Murfreesboro where both sides made their case, Todd. Yeah, Rory, uh, tonight was the public hearing and many were actually fairly supportive of the raise. They say that Rutherford County schools are keeping pace with surrounding counties like Wilson and Williamson County schools. But to keep that up, they need to keep up with the funding. And the only way to do that to raise the funding is through property taxes. I think with what we've heard about future growth, we need to stay strong and we need to stay equipped to prepare these schools to handle all these students that will come in from families like myself that move here from other places. Number crunchers with the county say property taxes are their only option since all the other taxes in the county are maxed out. The average homeowner would see their bill increase a little over $100 a year under the current proposed hike. Critics say taxes are too high in the county overall and it's making Rutherford County less attractive for businesses and residents who would in turn bring more tax revenue. We've priced ourselves out of the market, which is why we can't get businesses to come in here and bring jobs to support the, the taxes that we need to do our business. This isn't the way to go. 9% is outrageous. The full Rutherford County Commission is set to vote on the tax hike and the county's budget on June 26th. Rory.